Triathlon has always been considered as an endurance sport, not for the faint of heart. The preparation is long and painful. If done the right way, the process still remains painful. But the outcome is emotionally rewarding and fulfilling. The sport has naturally evolved throughout the years. But the experiences of those who have made it to the big dance in Kona, Hawaii and have succeeded remain the same. Epic. Priceless. For over 40 years, the Big Island has been a witness to thousands of stories of failure, success, heartbreaks, and greatness. For over four decades, Kona has not ceased challenging the human spirit and the human will to push over and beyond its comfort zone to defy the odds and fulfill the dream of becoming the best triathlete one can be. From 15 triathletes back in 1978, participation has grown to over 5,000 on its 44th year in 2022. Out of that figure, not even 1% of the total number of participants came from the Pearl of the Orient. As the red, white, and blue flag of the Philippines containing the three stars in a sun waved magnificently, the 47 Filipino triathletes who earned their slots from Ironman PH, the Ironman Legacy Program, and other qualifying races around the world proudly represented the country and marched in the Parade of Nations. A beautiful start to a weekend of world-class triathlon and a celebration of diversity. The number was small in quantity if compared to other nations, but it was huge enough to make it a historic event for Philippine triathlon. For the first time in Ironman World Championship history, the annual showcase of endurance talent took place as a two-day event. The ladies took center stage on day one, the 6th of October, led by the countries Reina Bulacna and Super Negrense Ines Santiago. The fighting Filipinas towed the line together with the best female triathletes all over the world. The atmosphere in the presence of all these women from different countries with different cultures immersing themselves in a competition in order to share one dream was magical. The experience was surreal. As the female champion Chelsea Sodaro has put it, this celebration of women empowerment should be the norm in the industry. Female athletes, regardless of what phase they are in their careers, should be recognized, supported, empowered. And this is what Ines Santiago, Mary Jane Baluyot, Chang Hitalia, Vanj Endaya, Naila Bautista, and Stacy Mendez did that day. They showed the whole world that the ordinary Filipina athlete can also make it to the big stage.
as the celebration of the ladies rolled over for the next two days, it was the turn of the men to see action on the 8th of October. The field of competition in the men's category was as fierce as the ladies. Family man Jet Ramos, corporate executive Luigi Robles, and super age grouper and first Filipino Kona finisher Mervyn Rencel Santiago went through the same lung-busting course as a third place Christian Blumenfeld, second place Sam Laidlow, and eventual top winner Gustav Eden. The grind was real for Mervyn, Luigi, Jet, and the rest of the Filipino triathletes. They had to dig deep as their mental toughness and physical limitations were tested. Some even had major injuries to consider. But in spite of these setbacks, they battled on. They stuck to their game plan, to what brought them there, their mental strength, their emotional strength, the fortitude to ensure competitive strength. They held on to all these in order to have courage in the face of adversity. And these were more than enough to help them cross that finish line. Three words! Anything is possible! Don't stop believing! October 6, 2022. October 8, 2022. These dates will forever be etched on the hearts of the 47 Filipino triathletes as the days that they made history by solidifying the place of the Philippines on the global stage of triathlon. But more than this recognition that they have achieved, they have sent a loud and clear message to their fellow Filipino triathletes back home that they too can be called an Iron Man in the big dance, on the big stage, in the World Championship. Because these 47 Filipino triathletes themselves have experienced that anything is possible.